For 50 years, commercial supersonic flights were banned in the USA. The reason? Loud sonic booms that occur when a plane breaks the sound barrier. Now, finally, such flights will become possible. NASA and Lockheed Martin have introduced the unique supersonic aircraft X-59, which can break the speed of sound without creating a loud boom. Thanks to its long, slender nose and special design, the perceived noise level on the ground when the aircraft breaks the sound barrier should not exceed 75 decibels. That's roughly the same sound level as slamming a car door. It's expected that the X-59 will fly at a speed of 925 miles per hour. The first test flights of the aircraft are scheduled for the next few months. Startup Living AI has introduced the adorable pocket robot named AB, which can answer any questions, show emotions, chat with its owner, and even recognize them among thousands of other people using their voice and appearance. Additionally, the device can display the weather, set timers, search for information on Google, take notes, and remind users to take their medication. There's also a Tamagotchi mode. In it, the user will not only have to charge the robot, but also feed it, put it to sleep, comfort and pet it. The device's size doesn't exceed that of regular headphones, allowing you to take it anywhere. A vortex is like a big whirlwind cannon, kind of like a giant megaphone. But instead of making a sound, it shoots swirling air streams in the form of rings aiming them accurately over long distances. How it works is pretty simple. At one end of the cannon, there's a flexible elastic ring or diaphragm attached, which stretches with rubber bands. When you release the bands, the diaphragm quickly pushes air out of the open end, creating a vortex ring. The speed of the swirling airstream at the exit is about 186 miles per hour enough to extinguish candles at a distance of 180 feet or cause serious damage to a mannequin placed 20 feet away from the cannon. Bring photos to life with one simple move. That's what you can do with the new motion brush feature from the neural network runway. This tool can add animations to five different areas in an image. To animate your desired picture, just upload any image or photo and indicate the areas you want to animate. After that, the neural network will do the rest. In the mountains of China, they're building a solar power station using cargo drones. The workforce consists of 40 copters that take turns as their batteries run low. Currently, they're operated by humans, but someday, autopilot will take over. At the CES 2024 Expo, Samsung unveiled a cute ball-shaped robot called Bali with AI, designed to help its owner manage a smart home. This device is a combination of a voice assistant, surveillance camera, and a hub for controlling smart household appliances. When needed, the ball-shaped robot can open smart blinds, start the washing machine, summon its vacuum cleaner robot buddy, or even turn on the TV. According to company representatives, the device is capable enough to be used as a fitness trainer. The robot features a built-in projector allowing it to display workout programs, cooking recipe videos, video calls, and other content. Additionally, the device automatically detects the angle of a person's face and adjusts the projection angle accordingly for optimal viewing comfort. Eyes are like the mirrors of the heart. That's the principle behind the Ready CVD Diagnostic Solution, which uses AI to assess the risk of cardiovascular diseases from a retinal eye image. According to developers, the technology can analyze a photo and provide results in less than a minute. The retinal eye image is captured using a special camera. Then AI analyzes the image, generates a personalized report, and saves it as a document that can be downloaded for further consultation with a doctor. 
Such quick and timely assessment will help patients start treatment on time and avoid heart attacks, strokes, and other serious conditions. The American startup AC Future has unveiled a concept for a fully electric house on wheels. Despite its boxy exterior, this mobile mini mansion looks very futuristic. However, its true innovation lies in the movable side and rear walls, which when extended, increase the interior space of the house to 398 square feet, comparable to the size of a small apartment. The interior looks modern and luxurious, a cozy living area, kitchen zone, bedroom, and bathroom are furnished with collapsible and modular furniture. The house is powered by solar panels installed on the roof and a large capacity battery. This combination allows for full autonomy for up to seven days. Additionally, the mini mansion is equipped with an atmospheric water generator, which collects moisture from the air and can produce up to 13 gallons of liquid per day. The Chinese company DJI has made a breakthrough in the heavy cargo delivery market by air. The new cargo drone Flycart 30 can deliver packages weighing up to 40 kilograms over a distance of up to 8 kilometers. Users also have access to a configuration with two batteries providing a range of 16 kilometers. The drone is equipped with a system of sensors and detectors that ensure safety during flight. In particular, it can detect approaching aircraft and alert the operator. In case of a crash, the drone is equipped with a parachute that ensures a soft landing of the aircraft and the safety of the cargo being transported. In addition to the delivery sphere, the drone is also suitable for use in military or rescue operations. The well-known American manufacturer of construction equipment Bobcat has introduced the concept of an autonomous electric track loader called Rogue X. This futuristic machine is designed to perform loading and unloading tasks remotely in places where there is a threat to human life. Among the features of the unit's design, it is worth noting the absence of an operator's cabin and the presence of two electric lifting mechanisms which provide the ability for vertical and radial along an arc trajectory lifting. Additionally, the loader does not emit harmful substances into the atmosphere, and the absence of hydraulic mechanisms prevents soil contamination with toxic liquids. According to company representatives, the machine is still in the early stages of development. However, it is already safe to say this is a technology of the future. The Bavarian carmaker BMW and Sol Robotics are conducting the final testing of a new revolutionary technology called LV5 Control Tower, the fifth-generation control tower. Instead of expecting autonomous vehicles to behave perfectly in the most challenging conditions, such as tight parking lots with constantly changing surroundings, the company has decided to shift some of the traffic organization work to the infrastructure. What does this mean? These control towers gather a huge amount of data from various sensors in real time. Based on this data, a three-dimensional picture of what's happening in their controlled area is created. And the vehicles that need to follow a certain route receive ready-made instructions from the towers, just like from a navigation app. It is planned that over time, such towers will be installed at all of the company's factories, as well as in major shopping centers around the world. At the CES exhibition in South Korea, artificial intelligence developed by Infinic and capable of recognizing products without barcodes was demonstrated. This is planned to be used in AI-driven stores called Mealy without any staff, where products will be automatically recognized as they pass through a special frame with a built-in digital camera and AI counter self-checkout solution. The AI can even distinguish between products with similar shapes such as apples and oranges. The system automatically calculates the weight and price based on visual dimensions and predefined formulas. 
All the buyer has to do is scan the QR code and pay for the purchase with their smartphone. This will be implemented in stores that are open 24-7. Other AI cameras analyze customer behavior inside the store, tracking anomalies to maintain security. The French corporation Neptech has developed the NEP Shuttle Marine Catamaran powered by an H2 engine. It runs on hydrogen fuel cells with zero carbon emissions into the atmosphere, powering lithium batteries. Mobile hydrogen stations will be installed for refueling along established routes. A 1 to 7 scale model has been built to conduct tests on maneuverability, hydrodynamics, and the strength of composite materials. If the checks go well, the company will release a full size version of the catamaran, which can accommodate, depending on the configuration, 150 to 170 passengers and two crew members. The NEP shuttle is equipped with smart features for pilotless trips, optimal route planning, and docking in the harbor. The design, with two underwater wings, minimizes hydrodynamic resistance in waves, reducing the likelihood of seasickness. Its maximum speed is 24 miles per hour. For more precise tracking of body movements in VR systems, the Surplex tracking shoes have been developed. They don't need a base station or webcams. Instead, they rely on 480 sensors built into the sole. These sensors, just 0.03 inches thick, are very sensitive to pressure. When a player changes their body position, the center of gravity shifts. By comparing this data with the embedded models in the virtual reality world, the player's movements are accurately reflected. When pressure doesn't change, for example, when lifting a foot, the shoes rely on a 9-axis sensor for tracking angles and movement directions. Surplex operates on its own batteries, providing up to 9 hours of autonomy. Connection to VR systems is via Wi-Fi. British man Steve Jones spent 1,000 hours and $5,000 converting the engine of a VC-10 passenger jet into a camper for family trips. The interior of the van is lined with plywood, insulation, and carpeting. The 13-foot capsule has narrow and wide doors, as well as a large panoramic window at the front. A wide swing outdoor allows for outdoor dining. Inside, there's a mini kitchen with a sink and a two-burner stove, a shelf, and a dining area with soft chairs. It folds out into a double bed and the seat back folds up to create two additional single beds on a single level for Steve's children. Inventors are offering him $31,000 for the trailer, but he's not planning to sell it just yet. The semi-submersible amphibious boat MSV Explorer allows you to simultaneously observe the surface and underwater worlds. It consists of two parts. The above water part has a plastic hull with air-filled balloons and a 360-degree viewing window. It can accommodate two people. The underwater part is equipped with a two-person cabin with panoramic windows and two spotlights for illumination. In the water, the boat moves using propellers powered by a 48-volt battery. The maximum speed is 6 knots. On land, the amphibian moves independently on rubber tracks. It can operate autonomously in water for up to 110 hours and on land for 8 hours. The boat can handle slopes of up to 30 degrees, making it easy to navigate onto shore or boat ramps on its own. Centive, a scout robot that was just introduced, is helping farmers by gathering information on plant conditions and insect presence while exploring up to 50 acres of fields every day without the need for human intervention. The robot has a unique system of rolling thin legs that allow it to step over plants without harming them. The design is modular so it can be individually adjusted in height and width depending on the crop being grown. The robot is equipped with multiple cameras and sensors, allowing it to gather data on birds, invertebrates, or mammals that pose a threat to the crop. Scanning is done above and below the leaves as well as in the soil. Furthermore, Centive identifies weeds and plant diseases using artificial intelligence image analysis. 
DeLorean unveiled the Omega 2040 concept, a car of the future designed for off-road racing, featuring a completely different shape from what we're used to today. This ultra-futuristic vehicle has a huge ground clearance allowing it to break free from the confines of the track and making it all-terrain capable. Front and rear spoilers are provided for maximum road grip at high speeds. Matrix vertical headlights and rear lights with rib structure shine brightly in any weather. The rear window is in the form of a grid with hexagonal cells that can rise above the surface. There are no side windows in the doors, but this is compensated by the huge windshield. Open wheels with textured rubber right up to the hub ensure reliable grip on the surface and provide protection against cuts. This astonishing exposed suspension with longitudinally mounted shock absorbers effectively smooths out bumps as it operates in both horizontal and vertical directions. Air drones have a restricted range and flight time because of their small batteries, which are used to reduce the total weight. The drone charging station located on a pole provides a solution to this issue. The charging station has boxes that open automatically, the doors of which trigger when the drone approaches. After landing, the box closes, protecting the platform from precipitation. The charging is wireless with a current of 220 volts, 20 amps, 400 watts or 500 watts. The station is available in two sizes, 54 by 42 inches and 59 by 73 inches for drones of different configurations. The station lowers down the pole for maintenance. Its high placement protects it from vandals. The drone charging station can be replaced in mountains, along roads, or in fields to conduct surveillance and rescue operations, without worrying about the autonomy of the drones. Gyro Glove Company has released a glove with the same name, designed to control hand tremors caused by Parkinson's disease. It's a hand stabilizer worn on the hand that helps control muscles by blocking erratic conditions. Thanks to this, people with hand tremors can hold a cup of coffee, write with a pen, or button up clothing. The foundation of this innovation is a gyroscope spinning four times faster than a jet turbine. It creates a counteracting force when the hand begins to move involuntarily. The gyroscope is located on the back of the palm and the battery is on the forearm. The battery lasts for four hours. The gyro glove weighs 1.27 pounds. In the future, the plan is to reduce the size of the glove, making it more compact and discreet. The price of this innovation is $5,899. Sony Afella is an electric sedan concept resulting from collaboration between Sony and Honda. Its standout feature is a powerful onboard computer that relies on data from 45 cameras, a telematic system and various sensors. The dashboard consists of multiple screens spanning from one edge of the cabin to the other. These screens also display images from side cameras which replace mirrors. The car is capable of automated driving while the driver responds to messages on their smartphone. It features an entertainment system from Epic Games and an operating system similar to Sony PS. Two electric motors, each with a thrust of 241 horsepower, transmit torque to all four wheels, making the sedan all-wheel drive. The base price for this innovation starts at $45,000. Subscribe to our channel to stay updated on our latest releases and interesting innovations. Simply click on the subscribe button located beneath the player. This way, you'll be notified when a new release is out allowing you to be the first to know about groundbreaking inventions.